of the Amistad and Falcon Reservoir, two main water distribution sources in the Rio Grande Valley have decreased significantly since 2002 by 75 percent, costing cities in the RGV to enforce stage two water restrictions. The city of Brownsville initiated stage two restrictions on July 29th to conserve 5% of its water. Some of the restrictions apply to fundraiser car washes, non-essential watering such as washing buildings and letting water run down the street. Public relations coordinator for the Public Utilities Board in Brownsville, Clary Quesada, says stage two will allow the use of water for landscape irrigation on certain days depending on your service address. The last digit of your service address is zero or one. You can water on Mondays and Saturdays. If your last digit service address is two or three, then you can water on Tuesday and Saturday, four or five, Wednesday and Saturday, six or seven, Thursday and Sunday, and eight or nine, it's only Fridays and Saturdays. Quesada also offers some tips on how to conserve water and even lower customers' water bill. So check your toilet, your faucets, and pipes for leaks at home. Sometimes, Customers might be surprised how high their bill is compared to last month, and it's probably most of the time because of some sort of leak. General Manager at the McAllen Public Utility, Mark Vega, says Stage 2 has restrictions on the time you use water, not on the amount of water you use. He also adds what can happen if conditions worsen and if Stage 3 is carried out. That's where there's restrictions on how much water you use, and that's a different story. So that's where we actually say, okay, home... You can use 15,000 gallons a month for your home, 10,000 gallons to irrigate. But stage two, there's no restrictions on water. It's just time. Quesada adds if water levels at the reservoirs continue to lower, the initiation of stage three could begin by late fall. For KVAQ-TV in McAllen, Amada Valdovinos.